Hey y'all, it's me Olivia Dior and I'm here with a electrolysis with an electrolysis update. So um let me get started. By the title, I am I have no facial hair on me. I finally got it all done this week. Okay, so let me tell you how the week went. Today is Thursday, so I started on Tuesday. Okay, so on Tuesday, I had a 15-minute session that I went, and she basically just got all of this part up here, okay? And then um, Thursday, I had an hour session. Boy, I forgot how much an hour was worth because she got a lot done in an hour. She got all my sideburns here, and then all my other sideburns here. Um, she really got a lot over here. Like, she really got a lot, um, and within that hour. So, by the time the hour was done, I only had, like, this much left. And, like, some on my jawline over here. And, you know, the, the, uh, the curly neck hairs that, um, that I get. I get really super long curly neck hair so yeah something in my hair so yeah and then so today was only 15 minutes and she got it hey Bailey you guys want to see my dog uh, this is my doggy Bailey he was just zoo I think I showed him to you guys before yeah he's old he's very old he's Thank God he's not a looker because he don't look anybody. Yeah. So I got 15 minutes done a day and she finished the whole thing. Um, let me tell you what I did to make it less painful. Actually, I'm so glad you're in here. You need to take your medicine. You need to take your medicine. Your medicine. Yeah, he's not having to take that. He doesn't have to take that medicine. I'm sit you on my lap. So let me tell you about the procedure I did to make it a less painful as possible. I think I have it in here. Oh my freaking goodness, freaking gracious. I don't have a fucking in here. <sighs> I'm gonna take a picture and show it to you guys. Okay, so I took this number cream called Abinol. Um, so what I did for the first time I went, I started applying it um, an hour before the appointment so um so say my appointment was at 9 30 i started applying that stuff at 8 30 on the dot and then i got saran wrap and put it on my face because i was laying in my bed my ass was tired <laughs> my ass was really tired uh, um so so i put this ram wrap so it won't get everywhere or anything um so yeah so then another 20 minutes later i'll apply it on again put this ram wrap back on and then literally 30 minutes again so i'll at least apply it a good three times before i went to the uh, electrolysis and that one that first time i did that it worked so well that's probably why she got so much done within that fi little 15 minutes because i wasn't like moving or telling her to stop like I did in the past, I was telling her like to stop and, you know, it hurts and, you know, lower down the current and, you know, because that numbing cream really freaking work. Um, I do suggest you do uh, use numbing cream um, and do it that way, especially if you're buying it online. I don't know how it is if you get the prescribed one, if you get a script from the doctor, but um, that one has been working for me. And it works better in that procedure. I always, the last time I did the hour one, I applied, I did the same thing, but without a saran wrap. And it does make a difference. Like, it wasn't as effective um, as it was without the saran wrap. So, uh, yeah. Because I was at school, so I couldn't be, like, wearing a saran wrap shit on my face. <laughs> on my face. And walking around, you know, campus looking like that. So I was like, yeah. So I just applied it um, within 30 minutes. And it still worked. It just wasn't as great as the first time, if you know what I mean. And then I did the same thing today without a saran wrap. And it's okay. Um, um, it, it actually really does a good job getting, like, around here. Like, it numbs this part 
first all the time and my neck like my neck got so numb one time like I was like slapping it like this like I couldn't feel nothing and uh, but here this gap right here and my sideburns and stuff didn't do shit I must still burn a little bit well it still hurt but not as bad but it still hurt a lot more still so yeah, so let me give you a close-up of my face because I know everybody wants to really look. I do have um scabs. So see all these little marks right here? Those are scabs right here, especially here. Right here. And then um there's a lot on my chin. I always get more scabs anywhere on my chin. So and all these. Yeah, and then let me show you um, about my neck. And then, so yeah. She missed a couple of curly hairs here, but it's whatever. Yep, so all of this right here is gone. This has scabs on it too, right here. But yeah, so I am clear for right now. Um, She told me to come back within like two, cause um, I asked her since it was clear now, like it's naked, like I can, it's, it's so naked, like so super duper 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 like is is no nothing on here like it's so weird touching my face and there's nothing on it <laughs> there's nothing on it and um you know so it's, it's definitely very 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 weird and um right now she has ointment on it so it feels kind of sticky but um yeah um anyway i was gonna say i'm still taking spinal lactone 75 milligrams and i start birth control Sunday so I'm gonna see how uh, that will affect the hair growth processes because I know with the birth control it correlates really well with spinal lactone when I first found out I had a herdicism that's all they did was put me on birth control and I didn't do anything so um yeah yeah so I'm gonna do an update about that apparently it'll only be four months apparently the end of this month I swear I've been on that thing longer than usual so yeah but that's all I had to say you know I'm very glad well that you got really oops I tore off one hair I don't know if you guys can okay let me put it like this right here right there it's just a curly hair It's whatever though, but yeah, um, so that's what I'm gonna do. I wanna wash my face. Um, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, so I'm very happy with my results. Um, like I said, I'll go back in two to three weeks later. There's already some hairs growing back, but they're so thin. And I can feel them, and they're super thin, so, um, I don't know, so. We will see next time also never mind let me tell you later because um i don't want to say it and, and i don't have it up so um yeah so if you like the video press like you want some more press subscribe please look in the description bar first before you ask any questions um because i swear i'll be making that description bar and some of y'all answers be in the description bar and y'all still want to ask questions that are in your face like right in front of your face so look in the description bar if you have any questions and if the questions you have that are not in the description bar, please put it down in the comment section. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, theories, whatever, you know. If you like the video, press like. If you want some more, press subscribe. Okay, bye. Well, since before someone asked, so the total time I did was an hour and 45 minutes within that one week. Because 15 minutes the first time, an hour the next day, and then 30 minutes today. So 60, 30 15 it's an hour 45 minutes just in case someone didn't know how to do proper math okay so if you like the video press like if you want some more press subscribe okay bye